to you. Many of your local electorate savings. A very safe seat. How do you feel about that? Are you, are you overly confident tonight? Well, we've taken nothing for granted. And we vote, we've worked hard for every single vote. Um, so I don't think we describe it as a safe seat at all. It's a seat where you have to fight very hard for every single vote. So how have you, how, how's your campaign gone? It's gone very well. I mean, we've had thousands of conversations. I think almost up to 10,000 in the last count. Uh, walked uh, hundreds of miles and I've had a great team here helping me. So it's been a great campaign. So this is usually a Labour seat with a, a huge majority. Do you think you will get a huge majority tonight? As I say, we've fought for every vote. Uh, I don't have a crystal ball, can't make any predictions, but certainly hoping for a good vote and a, a good result. And I hope that the people of Aberavon will send a clear message that we need a change of direction in this country. Hvordan synes du, hvordan bliver det at have en, en mand, der sidder i et andet lands parlament? Er du statsminister i Danmark? Jeg er bare rigtig glad på Steves vegne. Han har kæmpet og arbejdet simpelthen så hårdt. Jeg kender ikke nogen, der arbejder så, så hårdt, som Steven har gjort først for at øh, få mulighed for at stille op. Og så nu får de seneste øh, mange, mange måneder øh, kæmpet herude. Så jeg er bare stolt af, af Steve i dag. Og hvordan kommer I til at fejre valget? Nu skal vi først lige se, hvordan det hele går yeah. i løbet af, af i dag. Men øh, vi kommer til at være meget spændende i hvert fald. Ja, yeah, det er jo. Tak. Tak for det.